In this video, I will show you how to handle GSM module properly and also how to call and send SMS using Arduino Uno and make a simple mobile phone on your own. Let's get started. The main components used in this project is an Arduino board, a GSM module, a 4x4 matrix keypad, an LCD display, a microphone, and a speaker. Before going to project, let us know some brief information about the components used in this project. Arduino board. This is the brain of this project. You can use any type of Arduino board, an Arduino Uno, Mega, Nano, or Micro, or any type. Whatever you have, it, it controls all the other components based on the program we uploaded in the microcontroller, which means it takes the information from the keypad when we press it the buttons and displays it in the LCD and at the same time it gives the information to the GSM module. To know more about this, visit, watch my video Basics of Arduino and the next main components used in this project is GSM module. What is GSM? GSM stands for Global System for Mobile Communication. The idea of GSM was developed at Bell Laboratories in the year 1970. GSM modem requires a SIM card to be operated and operates over the network of range subscribed by the network operator. It was widely used in mobile communication system in the world. For more information about the GSM, visit my project page, link is given. Now coming to this GSM module, it works on 80 commands. 80 stands for attention. When the modem is in command mode, after inserting a SIM card into it, if we sent any character, it interpreted as a command for the modem. For example, ATD is used for dialing, ATA is used for answer, 80 plus CMGS is used for sending SMS through this GSM modem. For more information about the IT commands, visit link is given in the description below. Coming to connections, ground is connected to ground of Arduino board. TX and RX are connected to RX and TX of Arduino board. VCC is connected to external 12 volts power supply. MCP and MCN are connected to microphone positive and negative pins. And SPP and SPN are connected to speaker positive and negative pins. These are the pin connections of GSM module. Now coming to the connections for LCD, VSS is connected to ground of Arduino board, VTT is connected to 5 volts, VEE connected to ground, RS is connected to analog pin A0, RW is connected to ground, enable pin is connected to analog pin A1, D0 to D3 are not connected, and D4 to D7 are connected to analog pins A2 to A5, and anode is connected to 5 volts, and cathode is connected to ground. These are the connections according to my program. Link is given in description. Now coming to the connections for keypad. Keypad contains 4 rows and 4 columns. Row 1, row 2, row 3, row 4 are pin 1, pin 2, pin 3, pin 4 and column 1, column 2, column 3, column 4 are pin 5, pin 6, pin 7, pin 8. These are connected according to the schematics. Pin 1 is connected to pin 11. Same way up to pin 8 is connected to pin 4 of Arduino board. All the schematics and connections for Arduino board is given in my project page. Link is given in the description below. And code for the Arduino board is also given in the description below. Now open your Arduino software. This is the code for both call and SMS 
using G Arduino GSM module. Here we use three libraries software serial library, liquid crystal library, and keypad library. Firstly, we want to include these three libraries to the software. Now go to sketch, include library, and manage libraries. Now tap here. Software Serial, Liquid Crystal and Keypad Libraries and install all the three libraries. I already installed it. After installing, upload the program to your Arduino Uno board. After uploading the program, character C is used for calling using and character A is used for sending SMS. Character B is used for sending SMS. Now type C using 4x4 keypad matrix. After pressing C, character C, enter the number and press again C. For sending SMS, press character B and type the message you want to send and the number you want to send and again type B for sending SMS. For receiving the call, use character A. For more detailed information about the code, please feel free to comment in the description below. For more inf if you like the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. For more information about the Arduino board and Arduino projects, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching our videos.